Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to this event. We are gathered here today under very special circumstances. I will say the most crucial environmental negotiations we have seen in decades are taking place as we speak right here in Copenhagen. The COP15 negotiations have the attention of the whole world. A very, very large number of ministers, VIPs, heads of states and government would be gathered here in Copenhagen. And forestry is at the very center of, of the negotiations. There are all good reasons to expect the introduction of new mechanisms that will provide major new opportunities for sustainable forests. I don't think anyone could wish for a better background for our discussions here today. And today we have the world's best experts and leading thinkers on forests, climate change, development and environment, including also biodiversity. Ladies and gentlemen, as Minister responsible for forests, I could not imagine any better or promising opportunity for making a real and significant difference for the world's forests. COP15 has given us a unique opportunity. Please use it. Be active and contribute. The forests are keys to mitigate climate change. Deforestation is responsible for almost 20% of the global CO2 emissions. And afforestation can be a major contributor to reduce the concentration of CO2 in the atmosphere. Our task here today is to use this massive political and public attention to promote synergies between combating climate change and sustainable forests and protection of biodiversity. I think it is important that the outcome of today, based on the global and high-level attention, promote a global process on sustainable forestry, afforestation, and reversing deforestation. I will not entertain you with a long praise of initiatives in the Danish forestry, but you may like to know that in spite of being a small, low forest cover, cover country, we have also some experience to share with you. 200 years in afforestation and close to nature forest management principles are cases in point here in Denmark. The Danish government is very pleased to co-host this event and we have high expectations of its outcome. We wish to see that the event gives clear recommendations on how the global efforts on promoting the forest can be enhanced. Today we have, an, today we have our disposal a combined knowledge of a wide range of policymakers, science and stakeholders. There is cause to expect the results of this conference to have a great and durable impact on the global approach to forestry. This day could be the most important day for the world's forest in living memory. Please use this opportunity to contribute to a more sustainable future. Thank you very much.